It's something you see more at colleges than in high schools, black student unions. Students at a Virginia Beach high school want to change that perception, as well as spread the word about diversity in and out of the classroom. Ted on your sides, Asia Tolliver joins us with more on what's new at Kempsville High School. Asia. So it's called the Black Student Union, and it all started with one freshman's idea. Many others have jumped on board, though. The goal, to bridge the cultural separation at Kempsville High. Figuring out life as a high schooler can be difficult. You've got to juggle a social life, grades, and extracurriculars. But for some freshmen at Kimsville High School in Virginia Beach, there's another aspect they didn't anticipate having to deal with. Coming here, like noticing like the separation between racial groups during lunch, seeing who sits with who, you kind of get observant with it like day after day and you start to notice things. You walk around in school and people just continuously down you because of what you look like. And Carrington Smith says it's not just the way some fellow students look at her, but what they say. She says the N-word gets said throughout the hallways often. They say like it's something like it's a new catchphrase or something. Like that's degrading. So ninth grader Jordan Felder took it to school administrators, but not the problem, a solution in the form of a new club called the Black Student Union. I was feeling a little uncomfortable with, you know, the majority of white people here and then seeing not many of me. So I made this for more representation for girls like me and people like me. The purpose behind the Black Student Union, and I think the, the executive council has agreed, is to build community and to build confidence in class and to increase awareness of our culture. About 30 students showed up to the first interest meeting and they've already selected board members. Smith is the newly appointed president. It motivates black students to, you know, hold their crowns high, keep their head up. The first official meeting will be held in the fall. They already have plans to visit historically black colleges and host a culture show. And they want students to know this is for everyone and they'd love any and all support from all racial backgrounds. I'm Aisha Tolliver, 10 on your side.